Good morning. Good morning. How are we doing? All right, so we got to photograph this car. It's a press car. And I like doing the work myself. I like getting behind the camera. I like, you know, working that angle. Plus, Hyundai is expecting a review of this car. So we want to, we certainly want to deliver. Get a few shots. Understanding what the car is all about. This is a 2022 Hyundai Santa Fe hybrid. I enjoy the car very much. The only problem with having a different car every week is I walk around with this bag, I stuff all my things in here. So I always gotta make sure everything comes out. The most exciting thing about Friday is what car is next, I still don't know. Sometimes they'll, have, they'll hand me over the driving agreement like the day before, but today I haven't. I should do these photos the day that car arrived, but I didn't have the chance to do it on this one. Okay, I just finished taking the photos of my weekly car for the press cars. That is just typical Friday fashion here at the barn. But let me explain to you what we're doing. We're doing things a little differently and this channel is going to pivot. Historically, if you followed us, you know that we do weekly review type episodes, you know, kind of showcasing our latest inventory. And we'll still show you some of that. We don't want to let go of that. However, we're gonna kind of open our doors here at the barn. We're gonna show you who we are. We're gonna kind of just invite you into our lives and take you around the daily hustle, the daily grind. Based on the commentary and the information that you guys have provided us, you're more interested in our daily lives and how do we buy cars and where do we buy cars and where do they come from and welcome. So we have a new client showing up any minute now leaving on consignment a 2010 AMG G55. Tons of work done by Wheels Boutique, local company here. So, um, you know, it should be a cool car. It's gonna be the second G-Wagon we have in inventory right now. We have a 21 bone stock car. This is a previous generation car. You already signed the paperwork. Yeah. I have the license, I have the title, I have everything. So, we're good to go. Right. Sounds good, dude. Thank you very much. Yeah. Appreciate the opportunity. Yeah, for sure. Definitely cool. Yeah. Different. I think it's worth more for the guy that wants this, and right. it's worth less for the guy that does not want this. So it, it takes a very particular buyer, but we're gonna find it. That's what we do here. We're gonna list it. We got the photographer on the way now, and we're gonna shoot it across all the different platforms nationwide. The whole country is gonna see it. The car, I think, is uh, competitively priced, twenty-eight thousand dollars. And that includes the lift kit, front spring coils, rear spring coils, Fox shocks, front and rear, Fox steering stabilizer, wheels, the nitro trail grabber, the, the tires, the Bravis exhaust, OEM G63 factory brakes, custom carbon fiber trim, the brush guard delete kit. They spent a pretty penny. And you can see it, that's for sure. It makes it distinctive, I like it. All right, let's go. I think it'll do well in the Miami market. Well. I'm actually working on my real estate side of the business here. I try to service clients both uh, in all aspects of luxury cars and real estate. So. coming up on the market about 700,000 and he's looking to upgrade to a, a bigger a bigger unit and somewhere around the two million dollar range so I'm getting that search up and running and sent over to the client so we can schedule some showings for this weekend. So here's the website. Some of those shots if you follow our channel are going to be very familiar. What's the situation on the 275? 275 has been paid for, We're, we get the title today, and I'm waiting on transport confirmation. Where is it coming from? California. Is it going to go straight to Stewart, is not going to come here it's first? It's going straight to Greg, yeah, so Greg, Greg Jones is a renowned, renowned Ferrari restorer. We're talking about 1965 Ferrari 275 GTB that we just purchased for a client. So that car, um, it's, a, it's a driver plus plus car, basically is what it is. 
and we want to just go through it entirely, make sure everything is proper on it. But if there's anything that needs to be done, let's do it now before we deliver it to the client, because the client lives in from California, Florida, up to Connecticut. So a driver's plus plus car. It's a driver's car, but it's in really good condition. But yeah. it's not a show car. It's not a show car, but that's exactly what we were looking for. Right. The client is looking for that. 25 year ownership. So wow. I mean, to find it like that, it has that that pedigree of not being yeah. flipped from one guy to another, or being in collections. And right, it's not a, it's not a. It comes from an enthusiast and it's going to another enthusiast, yeah. and uh, the car hasn't been on the market, so we kind of like that. cafecito, alguien quiere? Muchas gracias, me vale. Cool. No. Luckily, we got the coffee shop right in the corner, so we just walk right to it. One of the best things that Miami has to offer is, is a Cuban coffee. Una colada y dos tostadas, por favor. They always typically do this. They, they give you one immediately to take, and the rest to bring back to the office. Two camera guys meet. <laughs> Manny, we're gonna photograph this 2019 812 Superfast. All right, it just came into inventory. The TDF blue on um, on that darker tan. They call it the coil. Beautiful. The combination is spectacular. The car is properly spec'd out. It's not like overdone, but it has everything you want. So without going over the top. This car we actually sold uh, originally about a year ago or so. The client is in line to receive the new GTS, so the A12 GTS. This being the coupe, of course, already discontinued. Um, and so to make room for that car, this car left the collection. So it'll be on the market shortly. I think we'll do very well with it. I think we'll sell it quickly, given the lack of inventory, given the color combination, the proper specs and mileage only 2,000 miles on a 2019 it's a car i think that is pretty hot pretty hot right now in the market as i sit here and wipe this thing down it kind of reminds me of that funny meme you know like what your friends think your, your life looks like oh yeah <laughs> and what instagram people think your life looks like well this is what my life looks like in real life I love the combination of this car. Uh, I just got a notification that the uh, listing agreement has been signed by my seller. So I just got a listing in the 1800 Club. It just got signed literally right now. And I just got a notification too. What are we we are getting the, the 2022 Jaguar F-Type. Convertible. Oh, that'll, for your... that'll be my car of the week. So nice. That's not good. Bad. That's but good. Not good. But not for you. <laughs> it's not good for me because I have kids. So a two-door convertible makes it my my week a little more complicated. But that's fine. All right, guys. So we want to welcome you again to basically our lives. <laughs> this is where we spend <laughs> most of our time, uh, days, weeks, months, and years. So yep. we're looking forward to this new style of video and channel. We hope that you follow along, hit that subscribe button, follow us on the Insta, on the Facebook, wherever other platforms, you can find us there, so. I think it was a pretty good day to start off. Some new inventory, some new listings on the real estate side, and some potential new yeah. uh, inventory as well coming in, so. And now we got a meeting upstairs, we gotta go. Yeah. We can't talk about that yet, but you will ultimately find out about it, so. Peace out. Until next time, peace.